So our next event is on the start line. This is our under events 15 and 16. That's our under 14 boys and girls combined event here for the 1500 meter walk. We do have two non-starters. However, we do have a field otherwise then of four boys and 21 girls. So clean start away here in the combined uh, race of the event 15 and event 16, which is the under 14 and boys and girls. In station one, we have Bo from Yarra Rangers, two, Jamie from Diamond Valley, three, Cody from Melton City, four, Lachlan from Berwick, five, Eliza from Campbell, Malvern, six, Hannah from Knox, seven, Matilda from Terrelgan, eight, Charlize from Bendigo, nine, Lucy from Shepparton, 10, Matilda from Whittlesea City, 11, Abby from Albury, 12, Alyssa from Coburg, 13, Alwyn from Carayo, 14, Lucy from Caulfield, 15, Zara from Brighton, 16, Alyssa from Sale, 17, Caitlin from Diamond Valley, 19, Belinda from Collingwood, 21, Lily from Shepparton, 22, Lily from Seaford, and 23, Nikita from Warrigal. So they're your starters in the under 14 boys and girls, 1500 metre walk. So leading the way at the moment is that of Jamie from Diamond Valley. Jamie comes in as the fastest qualifier and also the reigning champion from 2023 in as an under 13. So do expect Jamie to be out there front. It's Hannah from Knox sitting in second at the moment. Not too far up, far behind her is Matilda from Terrelgan. Now the two girls actually walked against each other last weekend at the Athletics Victoria State Championships uh, with Matilda uh, taking out first I believe and then Hannah second um, a bit of credit to Hannah in that instance as well is Hannah formed part of the Little Athletics Victoria New Zealand development tour group so she did actually walk over in Auckland in January and it took out the event over there at the Colgate Games so a big shout out to Hannah there in for that effort um, Charlize from Bendigo we spoke earlier about Charlize uh, her brother walked earlier and raced um, did a tremendous effort in the boys race so she's currently sitting third for the girls and sitting in second for the boys, I believe it looks like to me it might be Cody from Melton City. So out in front at the moment, as mentioned before, we've got Jamie, then Hannah, then Matilda. Charlize not too far behind, then Cody from Melton City just after those. Lily from Seaford. Matilda from Whittlesea City. Eliza from Camberwell, Malvern. And Bo from Yarra Rangers. So some great vision there of the back straight, uh, the competitors walking well. So out in the front at the moment, we still have Jamie from Diamond Valley walking very well. Not too far behind him is Matilda from Terrelgan and Hannah from Knox just after her. So they're your first three at the moment between the boys and girls. We've got Charlize from Bendigo, not too far behind. And Cody from Melton City, currently sitting in second for the boys. But the attention's drawn at the moment to, the, to our main camera with Jamie from Diamond Valley walking very well. Just past that start line. 
for the second last time in this race. He'll head towards the shaded area of the gum trees, which started to move back a little bit off the back straight. But heading towards his team tent in that at Diamond Valley. You'll see that come into shot in just a short moment. So it's Jamie working around with around about 600 metres to go. We'll see if we can get some vision of that back straight as well as with our competitors, the girl, the female competitors. So that's Hannah from Knox. And not too far in front of her will be Matilda from Terrelgan. You can see Charlize in the background there, Cody from Mountain City, and Bo from Yarra Rangers as well just after that. So... So just coming up to the bell lap. It's Jamie from Diamond Valley. Chasing him down at the moment is Matilda from Terrelgan. So just a bit of a caution there for Jamie. Just needs to tidy up his technique. So the focus and attention just draws to just making sure that that contact remains with the ground. So very important. There's two main key factors in the walk of contact and knee. So... We just need to ensure the athletes get around safely without three reports. Cautions are fine, but reports, the caution will obviously identify that there is something that they need to keep in touch with before they do get a report. So cautions are verbal. However, reports at this age group are not. So it's Jamie heading down the back straight. Just about to lap one of our competitors. So Matilda's starting to close some distance in on Jamie at the moment. So Matilda's walking very, very well. As I mentioned before, she did actually win the Victorian Championships last year for Athletics Victoria. And you can see Charlize there in shot at the moment. With Bo not too far behind her and Cody thereafter. So we will jump into vision of the main camera just a short moment we've got clear vision of Jamie making his way towards the finishing line Matilda right hot on his tail at the moment as well so Matilda possibly chasing down a quick time but it'll be Jamie that comes across the line in first for the boys Matilda first for the girls finishing strongly and almost ready to come into shot will be that of Hannah from Knox. So Hannah from Knox, wearing the number six, she'll come across the line as the second under 14 girl. So Charlize will come across the line as the third female. Bo will take out second for the boys. And just coming into shot now will be Cody from Melton City.
And walking really, really well at the moment. Coming across the line is our competitor from Carayo in Alwyn. Matilda from Whittlesea City. Across the nine is Abby from Albury. Lily from Shepparton. A strong finish here by the Diamond Valley competitor just after the uh, athlete from Sale. So that's Alyssa over Caitlin. Lucy from Caulfield. Lily. Nikita. Belinda from Collingwood. Lachlan from Berwick. And just the one competitor that looks to come. So just the one competitor making their way down with 100 metres to go. And our final competitor in this event, Alyssa from Coburg. So that's events 15 and 16, the under 14 boys and girls, 1500 metre walk.